At seventh race, pick five trotters are lined up, ready for the start. Here they come. They're off. Most interesting man left center of the track, small town throwdown. In between horses, it's Blenheim, and leaving from the outside, that was the favorite, Milady's Monet. Around the turn, heading to the back stretch, and up to the lead, Dubay, and small town throwdown. Small town throwdown from most interesting man, then a gap of two, that's Blenheim in third. Ladies Monet is settled in fourth, five and a half lengths from the lead as they near the quarter pole. And then comes Buen Camino and Swansea, and slowest away was DW's New York Yank. Up top controlling it is Small Town Throwdown at 7-2 through an opening quarter in 28-3. and three. Bartlett has the pocket with the most interesting man. And Blenheim is third. Nothing yet from the race favorite, Miladies Monet, who's on hold in mid-pack five lengths from this leader. And then it's Buen Camino, Swan C, and DW's New York Yank takes up the rear as they head to the half-mile pole. Open handicap trotters in pursuit of Small Town Throwdown. Leads it by a length and a half though very keen on the lead. Most interesting man, then a gap of two. Blenheim third. Miladies Monet has floated to the two-path. They won a half mile in 58 and four. 30 and one second quarter for Dubay and small town throwdown as he's in search of career win, 8,994. And he has the lead. On the outside, it's Blenheim taking his shot right now. Most interesting man has owned the pocket the whole way. But ladies, Monet's got to do a bit better. Then toward the inside is Buen Camino. The back markers are DW's New York Yank and Swan C. Small town throwdown has had things all his own way. Three quarters and 127 and one. Blenheim offering just mild pressure. Most interesting man toward the inside is third. And then comes Miladies Monet, who's really not doing enough. And then comes Buen Camino. Small town throwdown, who got that big time breather in the second quarter. Could pay dividends here. It's small town throwdown. Blenheim, most interesting man. And here comes Miladies Monet in the deep, deep stretch. Small town throwdowns. Ooh, tight at the end. And Miladies Monet made it very close. Close for third. Blenheim, our most interesting man. Moment here. Small town throw down on the point. Miladies Monet is not going to get the memo until late after floating away into a four hole. Kicks, I think the line may have saved small town throw down, but as we've long since established, I ain't wearing glasses for nothing here. Uh, Blenheim's going to wind up third, but uh, uh, small town throw down. Has proven, uh, again, the New York Cyrus State's graduate. If he's left to his own devices, obviously with a little urging here, he, he more than capable of doing what he did just now. Absolutely. I'm almost positive he held on for the victory. Uh, Jordan Stratton and Miladies Malay were coming, but they just, you could just kind of see they weren't going to quite get there. I don't think they did. It's very tight, though. Small town throwdown game on the front end, but he did get away with a very easy second quarter, and that was certainly a big key to his success, assuming he did win. Yeah, and there, uh, I believe it was a nice effort in his first open start. Blenheim left for seat, came first yep. up, and he's going to wind up third. Be sure Dubé was closing in on 9,000. I believe it's about six or seven away now. No stranger to this one, the uh, gilded son of Cash Hall, who will be a career millionaire before not too long. Again, the print is a little small for me. He's uh, not quite at 900,000 with this victory. Monsieur Allard sent him out, and Dan Dubé sent him home. Returning to the winner's circle, five small town throwdown. On by Eve Sarazin, Bruce Soulsby, a Lard Racing and VIP Internet. Trained by Rene Lard and the winning driver Dan Dubay, who's now six wins away from career win. Nine thousand.